incredible to think that this project started back in February. The bees may have absconded, it's sad, but at least now we can have a chance to look inside and discuss Propolis envelope, which is an interest of mine right now. It's incredible to be able to compare before Propolis and now after Propolis. Look how white the interior of this log is right now. Now let's take a look at the interior of the log now after several months of propolizing. If you're interested in the effects of propolis envelope, I highly recommend a paper that was written by uh, Renata Borba and Marla Spivak about propolis envelope in Apis mellifera colonies. Um, they're suggesting that the uh, propolis envelope aids the bees against the pathogen uh, Pinobacillus larvae, which is the agent of American fowl brood. Now you can see here that the propolis is, or they welded the log to the base with propolis, and inside the perimeter here, it's orange with propolis. They had a larger um, entry point, but they also like to use the bottom of the, the hive you can see this little doorway here, left and right, a few millimetres build up of propolis. Isn't it incredible that this propolis envelope is actually plant resin mixture that now serves as an antimicrobial layer around the whole colony and protecting the brood from bacterial pathogen infection. And I only discovered all of this because I started to read after becoming disappointed and really dejected over losing hives every year. And you know, bees are expensive to buy these days. I mean, you're looking at $200 a throw. Um, and it's becoming more and more obvious that the bees that are being supplied for $200 a throw are not quite healthy. I bought two nukes this year and they were just, it was just awful. Whereas my swarms in my other logs are doing great. Knock on wood. But there is something to this. Um, why is it that the honeybee coats the nest in propolis? There's a specific function of that. And why is it that we as beekeepers take that propolis and scrape it out of the hive? It's really goes against nature. Anyway, look, this log is not going to go to waste. It's now heavily propolized and will be ready for a swarm in 2021.